All right, today is the day we will be pulling the infamous Dark Gaia from my 100 pack box of OTS. Actually, it's not OTS, Speed Duel Tournament Pack 6. We'll see, though. I mean, I really don't know the spreads. I think I've already pulled six or seven ultra rares, which is really good. I mean, you get a lot of value in these uh, in these tournament packs compared to the OTS packs. So I'm probably going to be buying more of this. Hope you guys do enjoy them because, yeah, that's definitely going to be a thing that's going to be happening on the channel. I mean, I'm a speed duel channel now. Let's go. We got drop off. We got hidden armory and a, a galaxy cyclone. I believe that card is also part of the galaxy archetype. So it might be searchable, although I'm not entirely sure because I, I don't know the galaxy archetype that well. We got lost wind, a 420 blazer. Let's go. The better pull super rare wise. Dark calling is also up there, but there's something about blaze man. I really do love the guy. King of the skull servants, hidden armory and a dark summoning beast. All right. Yeah. So I really don't know the spreads. I'm assuming it will be at least 10 ultra rares uh, in this box. And, I mean, that's that's all right in my book for sure. Totem, Dragon, probably the better super rare. Um, just in the foiling, like foiling-wise, definitely the best super rare. But uh, I don't know if it's that playable. I mean, it's it's a decent card. I just don't know how, how played dragons are. I mean, I guess dragons are popular in any format, but... Yeah, I mean, speaking of Dragon Caller, Mr. Blue Eyes, White Dragon himself. We got Nova Master. I'll put him right over here as well. We haven't gotten that many uh, Nova Masters in the box. I think that's the third, third, the third one, yeah. Definitely pull two. That might be the third. All right. Black Magic Ritual. We got a Lost Wind and another Totem Dragon. I'll take that, man. I do want more Blaze Man than not, though. So maybe less Totem Dragons and a little bit more 420 Blazes. We got Black Magic Ritual. We got a Nova Master again. Hell yeah, dude, I'll take that. See, if it wasn't for his effect, I'd be playing Nova Master in every deck because he looks like a boss. He is definitely a G. All right, we got Wide Spread Ruin. Hell yeah, I mean, I'll take that, too, speaking of foils or the foil on the cards really cool foil on that card lord of d we got nobleman of extermination there we go hell yeah dude i will take that any day dude blaze man he just looks cool too my favorite rare or the version i guess of the card is from uh something star all star because the foiling is really good on that card dark calling there we go i will take that Hell yeah. I mean, we need Dark Calling for the uh, the Dark Gaia we're going to be pulling, right? So, hell yeah. Lost Wind. We got Black Magic Ritual. And Dark Summoning Mist. Ooh, that guy's dark. He's a dark boy. Can barely, can barely see him. All right. I mean, hey, man, we haven't pulled an Ultra Rare. That's pretty, that's pretty damn depressing. Power Bond. Hell yeah. Despair from the Dark. And... Hey, there you go, Blaze, Blaze Boy, Blaze Man. That's, uh, hmm, I think that's seven pulled. Wouldn't mind that being the most pulled card, though. Uh, Fluid Summoning Dragon. I wonder why that's in here, though. I guess it is kind of decent, because you can out, or you can uh, summon a really high level. Yeah, that's actually pretty decent in speed duels. And, or it should be, at least. First Ultra of the opening, at least. DD Double Days survivor not bad it's not bad it's just if it's not a dark gaia i get depressed you know all right hidden hidden armory the rock spirit and i, I thought we had it here for a sec but it is nova master there should only be two two fusions in the set and it's going to be nova master and dark gaia catch of the day we got tyrant dragon and a sub Submarine Boy or Submarine Roid. That was actually a me misspeaking. I thought the, I thought it was Submarine Boy. <laughs> we got a Wabaku. All right. That's pretty decent, I suppose. It is like a very... It stalls out games for sure. So maybe in an Exodia deck. I mean, in Speed Duels, you do start 
with a 20 card deck so it's easier to draw out exodia maybe maybe dragon caller despair from the dark and then a widespread ruin look, look at that foiling that is so nice so nice all right uh wait well, we've, we've only pulled one dark calling that's crazy that is crazy dark summoning based all right all right as far as value i mean besides dark gaia i think dd survivor is pretty decent like it's like 15 dollars or so unless i'm mistaken totem dragon every super rare is also kind of i mean it's not a lot of money but it's some money they're all about like two bucks which isn't bad i mean they're not worthless right wabaku despair from the dark <laughs> yo hell yeah every time i see it man i smile because that is that is definitely one of my favorite uh cards in here to pull not my favorite hero though i think my favorite hero will definitely be liquid boy because that, that guy's artwork is so cool galaxy cyclone hell yeah let's go that might be the most pulled super rare though i feel like i've seen galaxy cyclone more often than not we got lord of d there we go dark calling that's our second copy hell yeah all right come on and what if d disappointed if we pull three ultras though because that would be nice even if we don't pull the dark gaia but i mean come on we need to pull dark gaia and other blaze man hell yeah now we're at like 10 i, I mean i'll take those spreads any day uh magician black chaos wabaku and then a submarine roid uh, speaking of value i guess i'm gonna be probably buying a, a tournament pack five pack and there's a common in there that's 20 bucks in the market now people ain't buying it but they might be buying it depending on what is what was printed in the uh the new speed duel box that we actually did we get it yet i think it was teased yeah oh there we go oh dude that's why people love it it looks really nice it's like a 40 dollar card currently hell yeah man please one more one more at least Dude, this, this is, it looks really nice in this foiling. I think the, the highest rarity before this was a super rare, if I'm not mistaken. So, um, hell yeah. I will take that. We take those. We take those, boy. Ooh, front and center. Let's go. Drop off. Oh, they would have been better as an ulti. Hint, hint, Konami. Hint, hint. Widespread ruin. But, uh, yeah, we'll see. Speed Duel Tournament Pack... Five seems exciting to open. Um, seems kind of fun. So, probably going to be buying that. Stick around, guys. Make sure you subscribe if you want to see that. Because it's going to be... I mean, we're going to be pulling some... There's more heroes in that. And in particular, one of my favorite heroes. Plasma Vice. That is correct. Probably one of the worst heroes. But one of the coolest looking heroes. And uh, it's an ultra rare. So... Actually, wasn't he an ultra rare back in the day, too? I think he was a secret rare. No. Now that I think of it, he was, yeah, he was a secret rare. And that was it, I think. He was also printed as a common, I believe. Uh, we got Totem Dragon. Now, I mean, not the worst hero either. Like, I, I don't want to say he just flat out sucks. But, I mean, power <laughs> when there's power creep and stuff like that, yeah, he's definitely not that good uh, anymore. Nova Master. Hell yeah. Let's go. All right. Is Nova Master the least pulled card in this set for me? Hmm. We got King of the Skull Servant. Well, besides Dark Gaia, right? We got a widespread ruin. Hell yeah. All right. One more Dark Gaia. Let's do it. We got this. I'm just going to attack Nobleman of the Extermination in an Infernal a Prodigy. Hell yeah. He is a fiend. I was just making sure because his fusion materials are just generic... Uh, fiend and wait is it generic fiend I, I believe it is one fiend monster and then one rock monster hell yeah so even a modern Yu-Gi-Oh, it's pretty usable with since oh there we go ultra rare ah damn man not not what i wanted but banish of the radiance i think this is actually pretty expensive one of the more high higher cost higher value ultra rares it's still you know it ain't no dark gaia but uh i mean i'll take it so that is about 10. You get about 10 ultras per box. That's pretty good spreads. I mean, if 
Dude, if the OTS packs were like that, or the uh, the boxes, I guess, I would be, be I would be buying more more boxes. But uh, no, it ain't it ain't like that, unfortunately. All right, Magician Blank Chaos. I'm just gonna attack and another Dark Calling. Hell yeah, we take those. We take those any day. But uh, yeah, even if Evil Hero Dark Gaia is kind of decent. I mean, even in modern Yu-Gi-Oh. It's just if it get, if uh, the the effect gets negated, right? It's a useless um, card essentially. But uh, Dark Summoning Beast, Dark Boy himself, hell yeah! All right, the Rock Spirit Power Bond. Kind of curious what this does. Is it just Power Bond? Yeah, it looks like it's just Power Bond as a skill. I mean, that's pretty. That's pretty scary actually. Because uh, yeah, like a Cyber End Dragon. With uh, being summoned by that skill, dude, it, it, you start off the game with four thousand life points. You're not surviving that. You like, you gotta have something in the back row to stop that menace for sure. Elemental hero Nova Master, hell yeah. Dark guy, come on, one more, one more, man. We need it. Do it for the the hero lover, Konami. Ah, share the pain. You guys are sharing my pain, for sure. <laughs> Come on, Kanavi. Uh, I am the ultimate hero lover. I, uh, you need uh, you need to give me this one. Ugh. Galaxy Cyclone. We're winding down, too. We have like seven packs left. I guess it's still somewhat doable here, but... Kind of losing out hope. At least we pulled one, but... Dragon Caller and... Uh, ooh, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take that one. All right. Oh man, I'm kind of nervous. Dark Gaia, man. Got me speechless here. Mysterious Guard, catch of the day, and... Uh, oh, it's an it's another Ultra. I think it's the mo second most expensive Ultra as well. So, I mean, I'll take it. You can't just be like a steady spaghetti when you pull another Ultra. That's 11 Ultras then, isn't it? Got to think about this, actually. I think I pulled six... Wait, I'm I'm counting it after this video. I gotta count, man. All right, I'll leave them right there. I guess we can still. Is it greedy to say one more ultra? Is it? It is. But we're doing it. One more ultra. Come on. Ah, uh, share the pain. I don't think there's an ultra rare spell. I think all the ultra rares are. No, there's one trap. So there's one trap, and the rest are. Monsters, all right, come on. Oh boy, it's not. Ah, uh, Prodigy. Prodigy's all right. He's all right. He's he's uh he's one of the boys, but it's it ain't no dark guy, you know. We got drop off, tyrant, tyrant dragon. Ain't, oh boy, it's a fusion. Oh boy, it's either gonna be Nova Master, dark guy. Come on. Oh, that's the one time I'm disappointed to see. The boy, Nova Master. Oh, that was close. That was close. All right, Power Bond, the Flute of Summoning Dragon, and uh, it's a spell. Dark. I. That's good. That's decent. All right. Oh man, come on, one more Dark guy. I know I'm being real greedy here. <laughs> really greedy. Lord of D. Oh boy, is it? I. I, I feel like it's not, but. I'm going to will it to existence. It is. Oh, I thought it was a fusion. It's not. Oh, dark summoning beast. That's unfortunate. That is a really dark boy, though. You can really, like, you, you can't even tell where his face is. Where the hell is his face? What the hell? I mean, it's all right, man. It's all right. We got one. We got one. We got a dark goblin, the banisher of radiance, a double days survivor, and the infamous good boy, Evil hero, Dark Gaia himself. I'm going to actually do a quick trick edit. All right, so we are back, boys. So we got uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven previously. Uh, let's see, seven, eight, let's see, nine with uh, double Ds here, nine. Ooh, I don't want to ruin these cards. I know I should be uh, sleeving them. I'm lazy, guys. I put them in a safe spot, though. Don't worry. So that should be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 
9, 10, 11 with the boy Dargaya. I mean, those spreads are really nice. Definitely going to be opening more of this uh, type of product in the future, guys, because let's be honest, the OTS tournament pack, I love opening it. That's why I do it on the channel. But the spreads are so low that it's kind of depressing. And also, they all come in pretty darn damaged, at least in the speed duel world. I have seen some that are, you know, the edges are not that good, even in Dark Gaia right here. The top left is a little bit weird, but that's kind of nitpicking it. With the OTS tournament pack uh, ultis, they're all damaged. Like, they're, it's apparent that they're damaged. With these, it's, you know, you got to actually be really picky about. So... Look out for more of this on the channel. Catch you guys in the next one.